taking my time to get perfection sometimes. You got me feeling so weightless. Top of line, I'll be taking my time to get perfection sometimes. I need to just take a ride away. Good day, good day, people. So today we're doing a master. Master 6 on the 07 plate, 2 litre petrol. Uh, just doing a quick service and an O2 sensor. So, first things first is take your bottom cover off, then your oil filters at the front here, and where the spanner is now, that's where your sump plug, sump plug is 17 mil. So, let's get that undone. See you there, 17 mil. So we'll get that undone, drain the oil, then we'll drop the filter. So that's the, that's the oil change, we're all drained out, just put the bolt back in. Time to do the filter. So with the filter, I use the, the chain remover, a lot easier, a lot easier to get in with it as well. So I've just cracked it a bit and you should be able to do it by hand. Always make sure you've got something to catch that oil underneath it. Drain it out like that. Let that drain for a bit. So, after you get it off, give it a good clean. Time to put the new filter on. All I do is wipe a bit of oil around the top of the rubber of the new filter just to make it seal a lot better. And then you drop it in the oil. This is the plain bit, trying to get it to bite on. There we go. You want to just do it hand tight. Uh, don't want to do it too tight. Now you've got a good firm grip. That should do it. So that's the new oil filter on. Some plug back in, time to top it back up with oil. Right, so before I drop the oil in, I'm going to do the spark plugs. So, first things first, undo all these 8 mils here, all the way across. These will release your caps. You want to unplug them here, just press that little tab down and pull on every single one. And just make sure you put them back the way you find them. So, once you've got the spark plug out, uh, the size is the 10 mil for your spark plug. Make sure the old one matches the new, same length on the thread and everything. So yeah, time to refit it. So that's the new spark plug in. Uh, I'm doing one at a time just to make it easier so I don't miss up, miss up the cables and that. So, when you got these off, make sure none of your rubber split, make sure there's no oil on them, as that will damage. If you get any white streaks across the rubber and that, that means you're yeah, sparking out. Means uh, something wrong with this. This one looks alright so far. Get on with the other three. That's all for spark plugs done. Alright, these. These just screw on. Make sure you put them back in the right place. Uh, they are 15 mil bolt on the head. There. These are to hold your top cover on. Your top cover just pushes on to these. And it holds your top cover on. So make sure you put them back in the same place you find them. Uh, so that's them done. Spark plugs are done. Next thing to do, we'll do the air filter. So on the air filter, you got a clip here and a clip behind here. Just 
Pop that up. Like that. Lift off like that. A bit awkward. Put your filter out. Replace it with a new one. As you can tell, that's gunged up. Pretty shit. So, while you're doing it, make sure it's clean inside, you ain't got any bits. So, yeah, there's a few bits in there, so I have to take it completely off. So, squeeze that, pull that off, undo that to take that off, then this lid will come off. So this is the new air filter uh, to the old one. See there is some difference. So we'll fit this, make sure it's gonna fit. That's the new air filter in. I've ended up having to take the pipe off as I need to clean some dust and that from out of the box. So all it is two ten mils. Just undo one, pull your pipe off, and your lid lifts up like that. Clean it out, put your new filter in. So, yeah, let's get it back together. So, there we go. Air filter done, spark plugs done, oil filters changed. The only thing left to do is top it up with oil. So, we'll get that done. So, putting in the oil, putting about a litre. So when you put about a litre in, always go underneath the car. Make sure we've got no leaks. That looks fine there. Uh, got no drips. Coming from there neither. So yeah, that's all good. So all we've got to do now is fill it up. Uh, it says 4.3 litres to take it up so all I do is drop 4 litres in let it set and then just keep topping up when needed so there we go service done on the Master 6 so yeah oil filter done air filters done and spark plugs are done topped up with oil put 4 litres in for now uh, next job is going to be the O2 sensor. I will film that separate so whoever just wants to see that can just jump straight to that video So catch you in the next vid